Sweden harbors the magic of Viking women and the mysteries of witches, with Sir Strumming, fermented fish, becoming a part of tradition. Join Ascent's world as we unveil these secrets, diving into a world of strength and enchantment. Are you ready to face the unusual? Watch till the end. In Sweden, witches were once burned at the stake. This is just one fact from a country with a complex and diverse history that begins with the Viking era, when Swedish sailors and warriors embarked on far-reaching expeditions to the east and south, reaching as far as modern Russia, Ukraine, and even the Mediterranean. These expeditions enriched the nation through trade and piracy, fostering cultural exchange and spreading skills such as shipbuilding and navigation. These skills led to the dreadful tradition of slave trade, which, however, did not bring happiness to the country. Sweden's story as a wealthy and developed nation started with a long process of social, economic, and political changes, leading to the formation of modern society. The Middle Ages saw Sweden gradually expand its territory and strengthen royal power. During the Renaissance and the modern era, Sweden became a significant player in European affairs, especially during the Thirty Years' War, achieving substantial territorial gains, which were later lost, leading to a policy of neutrality during both world wars, preserving its economy from destruction and focusing on internal development. In the post-war period, Sweden quickly modernized, investing in the social sector and technology, ensuring a high standard of living. The Swedish Social Democracy Model Featuring active state intervention in the economy, high taxation, and extensive social guarantees, played a key role in shaping the country's modern identity. A unique combination of maritime romance and high technology, Sweden has a varied climate, including a temperate climate in the south and a subarctic climate in the north. Summers in the south are warm and winters mild, while the north experiences cold and snowy winters. The Swedish mountains offer beautiful landscapes, including Abisko National Park. Archipelagos like the Stockholm Archipelago and the Gothenburg Archipelago offer maritime adventures. Northern regions like Lapland allow for viewing the northern lights and engaging in winter sports. Sweden is also rich in national parks, including Skulaskogen and Gotland. This makes Sweden a wonderful place for travel and nature enjoyment. After work, Swedes often spend time in parks and mountains, mainly working in the high-tech sector. Sweden's economy heavily relies on exports, including high-tech goods, machinery, pharmaceuticals, and the service sector. Investments in science, research and development, along with a high level of education among the population, help maintain the country's competitiveness in the global market. Political stability, transparency in governance, and effective law enforcement are also crucial factors contributing to Sweden's high level of development, reflected in its stunningly beautiful cities. Walking through the streets of Sweden's capital Stockholm immerses you in centuries of history, diversity of eras and styles, where every detail of urban environment seems thoughtfully designed and functional. Swedish streets brimming with greenery and cleanliness are filled with beautiful men and women. If you want to learn more about this, watch till the end. Stockholm, situated on 14 islands where Lake Mälaren meets the Baltic Sea, features a unique combination of water and greenery. The old town, Gamla Stan, with its narrow cobblestone streets and colorful buildings from the 17th and 18th centuries, is the heart of the Swedish capital, showcasing the splendor of northern Baroque. Nearby is the Royal Palace, one of the world's largest royal residences with over 600 rooms. The 20th century modernism is also reflected in the city's architecture, as seen in buildings like the City Hall and the Stockholm Concert Hall, where the Nobel Prizes are awarded annually. It's one of the most beautiful places for a stroll. Swedes enjoy walking along the picturesque shores of the islands connecting Stockholm, admiring views of ancient buildings and modern architectural masterpieces. In warmer months, Swedes prefer spending time in parks and nature, often having picnics or simply enjoying the sun. In winter, city dwellers do not shy away from walks, dressing warmly and often stopping in cozy cafes and bars to warm up with a cup of coffee or mulled wine. Walks through Stockholm for locals are a chance to enjoy the beauty of their city, meet friends, or simply relax after a workday, immersing in an atmosphere of tranquility and peace, so characteristic of the Scandinavian way of life. If you decide to visit the capital of Sweden, you'll likely be amazed by the local women, who inherit the best traits of their Viking ancestors. They possess a unique beauty, 
as if drawn from the depths of Scandinavian legends and sagas. Despite changing times, they still stand out for their natural beauty and style, blending simplicity, convenience, and elegance. They favor minimalism in clothing, focusing on quality and eco-friendly materials. Hair is often worn loose or in a neat bun, and makeup accentuates natural features. Swedish women are active and independent. Many engage in sports, lead a healthy lifestyle, and actively participate in societal life alongside men. Matching the women, Swedish men also exhibit grooming and stylish simplicity in clothing. They prefer quality and functional attire suitable for work and leisure. Beards and neatly trimmed hair complete their Viking descendant look, emphasizing masculinity and grooming despite a somewhat fierce appearance. Swedish men are known for their love of nature, active lifestyle, and gender equality. They often engage in sports, travel by bicycle, and spend time with family outdoors in city parks and squares filled with neatly trimmed trees and flower beds, serving as oases of tranquility and rest for citizens who enjoy spending time with friends and families, enjoying conversations over a cup of coffee or dinner. Cafe, restaurant, and shop workers are highly professional and genuinely eager to make the service as pleasant as possible. Restaurants and cafes offer dishes made from fresh local products, highlighting the importance of healthy eating and sustainability. Service in Swedish establishments is always accompanied by a smile and warm attitude, making each visit memorable. In parks and playgrounds, parents can be seen actively participating in games with their children, reflecting a strong cultural commitment to family values. Yes, no one will force you to eat the smelly surf drumming. On the streets of Swedish cities, there's a strong sense of community and respect for personal space. People are polite and friendly, but not intrusive, valuing privacy and tranquility. This harmony between individualism and collectivism, modernism and nature, makes walking through Swedish cities a truly unique and inspiring experience. However, it's also worth paying attention to the problems of this seemingly perfect country. Modern Sweden, despite its cultural commitment to equality and family values, faces serious challenges that complicate family planning. The main difficulty lies in the high cost of living and housing in major cities, making it difficult for young people to purchase their own homes. This is an important aspect of starting a family, also affected by strict housing market regulation. Furthermore, achieving a work-life balance poses another obstacle. Despite a developed social support system, young people struggle to find jobs that offer a decent income and allow time for family. Career demands and the need for continuous professional development increase pressure and lead to changing social expectations. Perceptions of family values also play a role. The pursuit of individuality and self-realization leads many to postpone starting a family, resulting in an increased age of first marriage and potential fertility issues. In addition to this, maintaining long-term relationships becomes increasingly challenging in a highly mobile society with rising divorce rates. Young couples must find ways to preserve connection and understanding amidst the changes and challenges of modern life. Despite these issues, Sweden successfully addresses its demographic and family challenges through a comprehensive approach. The state provides extensive social support, including child benefits and unemployment benefits, to ease the financial burden on families. State involvement in housing market regulation ensures access to housing for young families, and employers offer flexible work schedules and long vacations, promoting a work-life balance. Educational programs and information campaigns help young people make informed decisions in family planning, and psychological support for families is available, helping them resolve conflicts and maintain long-term relationships. Changing socio-cultural stereotypes and adapting to changing circumstances contribute to a more flexible perception of family values. Thus, Sweden actively works to provide its citizens with environments for a happy and healthy family life. If you're planning to visit Sweden as a tourist, there are several important points to consider. Your journey to Sweden can start with a visit to its cultural capital, Stockholm. A city on the water divided into numerous islands, Stockholm will enchant you with its architecture, historic districts, and a variety of museums. Don't miss the opportunity to visit the old town, Gamla Stan, with its narrow streets, the Royal Palace, Kungliga Slottet, and modern art galleries, and gradually move on to natural landmarks. Sweden is famous for its nature. Visit the Swedish mountains, Skanderna, on the border with Norway to enjoy mountain landscapes and active sports, such as skiing and hiking. 
for water adventure enthusiasts, the Stockholm Archipelago and the Gothenburg Archipelago offer excellent opportunities for sailing, kayaking, and simply relaxing by the sea. Swedish cuisine also deserves special attention. Try local dishes such as meatballs, kutbuller, herring with mashed potatoes, sil och potatis, and traditional strawberry waffles. In cafes and restaurants, you will also find a rich selection of fresh seafood and organic products. For a complete immersion in Swedish culture, don't forget to visit the local saunas and baths. Sauna is an integral part of Swedish tradition, and it's a great way to relax and enjoy the warmth after a day of travel. It's also important to respect local rules and laws, including trash sorting regulations and restrictions on the sale of alcohol. And finally, enjoy the tranquility and natural beauty that Sweden offers. Whether you're hiking through the forests of Lapland or simply strolling along a lakeside, you will appreciate the beauty and uniqueness of this amazing country. Don't forget to leave a comment if you found this interesting. Be sure to visit Sweden and watch the video that appears on your screen. I'm sure you'll like it. Until next time.